YouTubers and welcome to yet another beer review with me, Peter, the Master of Papa State, looking at yeah, yet another beer from BelgianBeers.com. So thanks a lot to the guys at Belgian Beers for sending this one out. Um, check them out, guys. This one is another beer from uh, Earthel, Earthel, Wittin, whatever they call it. And this one's called Samaranth. And the name here really reminds me of a band from Sweden called Amaranth. Or Amarantes, as I think some sweet says say, but apparently they say themselves it's Amaranth. I call it Ava Metal because it's like poppy with some growling. So I'm just like the in the Swedish mellow death sound, but yeah, to me it's Ava Metal, but it's like a guilty pleasure, you know. <laughs> but on to the beer. This is a quad from uh, Wutin or Earthel, and it's a Amaranth. It's on 11 and a half percent. That's crazy. Uh, says, let this fine amber golden samaranth intrigue you with its perfect balance and full body taste and complex flavors. And it's brewed with water, malt, hops, sugar, and yeast. So, yeah, that is intriguing looking. It's actually not as dark as some other quads. Man, I've been drinking a lot of Belgian beer lately. I need to get back into getting some IPAs and all. But you've had the reviews all mixed up because I have a decent back catalog. But there it is. That looks quite nice. It's a nice kind of, well, it says amber, burnt, uh, amber, burnt orange, something like that. A uh, nice little tan head on there. Let's check out the aroma on it. Mmm, yeah, I'm getting uh, a little bit of uh, a caramelized apple. Um, with a hint of chocolate to it as well. Dried dark fruits, uh, sugar, molasses, and I love not, not, not molasses, but maybe like a kind of muscovado sugar or brown sugar. Breadiness, some spice, jammy, marmalade characters to it as well. But it smells a little boozy, but 11.5%, I mean, that's kind of expected, but it smells, it smells pretty nice. So, yeah, let's give this one a taste. Cheers, guys. Yeah, that is quite nice. <laughs> Definitely prefer this over the <laughs> the hoppage. It's pretty damn good. Um, the flavor though, it's interesting. Very full on the flavors, but then they dissipate and you're just left in the aftertaste with this doughy, bready caramel taste. <laughs> and up front there was a lot more flavors, but I'm just gonna take another sip here. Mm. Yeah, yeah, up front, caramelized dark fruits. Again, like a caramelized red apple that you get for Christmas. Just what it reminds me of. Um, but definitely like the dry, darker fruit state raisin. It has a hint of chocolate on the back end, but very sugary, very sugary. And sweetness is balanced by a good peppery spice and bitterness, but it's quite sweet. Alcohol is slightly traceable. You can definitely taste it's a high ABV beer, but really nice caramel toffee. Dark toffee almost flavor. It does have a doughy, darker bread, breadiness. Not like rye, but just like a darker bread, heftier bread. Um, then you get the kind of spicy, peppery notes, which is what lingers on the aftertaste. But I like it's more on the sweeter side, because as you know, I like the sweeter beers. And this is one of the beers that leaves that sticky gloss on your lips. But nice kind of brown sugar, Moscovado type of sugar uh, character to it. And then you get the sweetness again, as I said before, it, it does balance out a little. But if you're not into too sweet quads, this might not be your thing. But I th actually think this is rather tasty. <laughs> not the best out there by any means. My favorite is still Rochefort 10, <laughs> I guess. Um, but it's pretty damn tasty stuff still. I mean, I'm, I'm really on the fence of going 90, 88, something along this. But I'm gonna. Stay in the middle then and go 89. It just needs maybe a little more fruit ester and dark fruit for to be a 90. But 89 is still a pretty damn good quad. Uh, from a well, a brewery sounds like I should check out more beers from. Um, quite tasty stuff. Samaranth here uh, from Earthel. So guys, definitely let me know what you think of the Earthel Samaranth if you've had it. As always, guys, remember to come subscribe, check out their Facebook fan page and Twitter. I'm going to say cheers, and I'm going to see you guys in another video.